Hello Amazon! It is me and I hope you all are having a great weekend. I'm not sure when I'm going to get this video uploaded but this is a jewelry haul. I have a lot of stuff to show you guys before I take my vacation. Plus I am planning on you know what jewelry to take on my vacation. We shall see so let's just get started. I do have some costume jewelry as well. And again, I just have stuff that's been sitting here for a long, long, long time, as well as some new things, so I don't know what I'm going to show you first, but we will get through it. Um, this is a brooch, fashion jewelry, cute little elephant with AB crystals. I just got this last week, so, well actually, no, 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 nope. This one I got, let me see, today's Saturday... I think I got this on Wednesday. Yeah, I bought this on Wednesday. So, very, very pretty. Very nice quality. You guys know I love brooches. Um, okay, so last week, there's a store I go to that has fabulous costume jewelry. So, I picked up these earrings. They're green. I hope they're coming across on camera. And these are just amazing quality. These are not the cheap pieces. But you guys know I don't believe in spending more than $25 to $50 on costume jewelry ever. So these are beauty statement earrings. Um, I don't know if you guys follow the trends for what's popular for this year and next year. Basically the dainty jewelry is done. <laughs> statement everything basically. Whether you're going to do pearls, hearts... Uh, earrings, bracelets, or necklaces. Basically, the, t the new jewelry trend, if you ask me, is opulence. That's the way I see it, opulence. So, these are for pierced ears, obviously, so I got those. Uh, no particular order here. I purchased these AB Crystal Bangles here. Because I feel like I never have any AB crystal bangles when I need them. So, that's a set of three. These are only a dollar. So, that was pretty cool. Love those. They're a little bit big for me. But, they're really pretty. Um, let me see. What else do I have here? Another pair of earrings. They're green. These have the comfort disc in the back because they're kind of heavy. But aren't they beautiful? Again, these are right on trend. The opulence trend. So basically more is more larger, bigger personality pieces. Um, you also have uneven earrings being the trend, but I don't like that trend too much. <laughs> um... Let me see what else do I have to show you guys. Now these pretty things here came from Bobble Bar. And what I love is this is a detachable earring jacket right here. So you can wear it just a little circle here. Or you can wear it like this. I've taken this off and put my um, sterling silver and gold studs in through the hole. So that's very cute. In fact, let me see if I can just show you guys. Yeah, so if you can see that. Um, yeah. They come apart like that. So you can wear it just that. Or. Or you can put this through your ear. Then your earlobe would be here. And then you put this in the back. So you have a front back look. Or. You can piece it all together, then put it through your ear, and then put the backing on. So this is nice. Bobble Bar makes decent quality jewelry. So I thought that was pretty cool. I Like I said, I love that the jacket is detachable and I can wear it with my real earrings. So that's pretty, pretty cool. Um, I also picked up these pretty earrings I just think earrings like this are really nice uh, on a hot summer's night out you know they're pretty glamorous or you know with the just imagine with a cream colored sweater this is really really pretty 
So I feel like my tastes have evolved over the years when it comes to fashion jewelry. Um, I also picked up these, and these are big hoops. These were only a dollar, and they're really, really pretty. Again, very glamorous. I was thinking, you know, when I go out for cocktails, I wanted something really, really sparkly and lightweight that I don't have to worry about. And that will show up no matter what I do with my hair. So that's really, really pretty. Really, really glam. Super sparkly. Um, what else do I want to show you guys? I guess I'll just show you all the fashion jewelry stuff. Um, I purchased this. This is from the same seller where the earrings and the brooch came from, but it's actually a hair clip. So, I thought that was really, really nice. Really, really pretty. I like pretty hair clips, so it's solid metal. Oops. Solid metal. And just a nice hair clip. So that was different. He only charged me a dollar for that. Um, I'm going to go back to the store where I got those big earrings because I also got these. Look at these red ones. These are beautiful. And if you follow me on Instagram, you've probably seen all this stuff already. Well, at least these I think you've seen already if you follow me on Instagram. So these are gorgeous. Yeah, I love a big statement earring. It's just that... I literally will pop them in to snap some selfies or have my picture taken and then I take them right out because they get heavy. You know, I just can't wear these big earrings for a long time. But, I mean, they're so fun to take pictures and they're absolutely beautiful. So that's my advice for that. I mean, if you're going to wear them, just wear them for your pictures and then take them right off. This is another brooch. So I have a vendor where I buy my brooches from in Brooklyn and... He's got some really pretty ones. So this is a mermaid. And I just think that's absolutely gorgeous. She's holding a little faux pearl. So she's a brooch. Very, very pretty. Um, and the last brooch I got, I call it my lovebirds brooch. Very pretty. Very, very pretty. Look at that. All right. Let me clear this out of the way. Let me see what else do I want to show you guys in this video. Um, quickly, some non jewelry. I picked up uh, a room fragrance spray. This smells amazing. I don't know if you guys have ever tried fragrance room sprays, but they're very nice. These are my first times buying them. They're amazing. I bought that one. And then I also bought the rose petal scent. It's so nice. Like, you spray the room, and then, like, you know, once you walk in, you just get this really nice burst of scent. It's amazing. Um, okay, so, I have a ton of jewelry to show you guys, and I don't even know where to start. Um, I'll start with these. Oops. These are blue topaz earrings. Now, I ordered these from a jeweler that specializes in diamonds but they're kind of not what I wanted as you can see the post is bent right there the post is bent which I have to fix that carefully um, I wanted ones like the Duchess of Sussex has but these blue topazes are too dark she has a lighter blue topaz this is like an electric blue topaz so yeah I'm gonna have to try again but these are pretty so, I'm totally going to have to bend that post back. Let me... Yeah, that's better. That's better. But they're beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Um, 
where else can I start? So there was a ring I wanted on Evine, but the price was ridiculous and it was just a big quartz for their Vegas special. So what I did was I went and I ordered a loose quartz the same size. So I'm going to have this made into a ring. <laughs> they were charging like I think $300 for a quartz ring in silver, which I thought was absurd. So I ordered a 25 karat uh, crystal quartz and I'm going to have this set into a ring. So take that, Yvonne. <laughs> so that was beautiful. This came from India and it's absolutely gorgeous. I can't wait to have that made into a ring. I think I want to have it set east-west. So I think that's like my new thing, guys, buying uh, loose stones and having pieces made. Um, let's see. Where are my thingamajigs? Okay, so from John's store, and these have been sitting here for a long time. We have citrine studs, and these are set in 14 karat gold. They've been sitting here forever. I think they're either in 10 karat or 14 karat, and probably 10 karat because they're starting to tarnish a little bit, but they've been sitting here for months. <laughs> So yeah, you guys know John sells uh, gold and gemstones. So yeah, these are yellow gold and citrine. Very pretty. Um, also from John's store. Let me see if I can get this. These are CZ earrings. I only have one right here. And I don't know if you guys can see, but it's like their hearts. And you've got rose, silver, and then yellow. Let me get the other one. Again, these have been sitting here for months. But if you follow my Instagram, you've seen these. These look like real diamonds, but they're CZs. Um, and so, yeah, these are beautiful. Absolutely beautiful earrings from John's eBay store. And also, you guys know, unfortunately, I lost a two carat ruby earring a few weeks ago. And you guys saw the smaller ones that I got to replace them. Well, I also got some larger rubies, <laughs> some really, really nice rubies to replace the ones that I lost. So here they are, which I hope you guys can see. Look at these rubies, like they are amazing I had these custom made <laughs> and they are beautiful they look even better than the ones I got from Ross Simons that I lost so yeah these are five carat rubies in each ear <laughs> and that's what I wanted and they're set in a princess crown setting which is what I wanted the jeweler did an amazing job on these I had to wait weeks for these to be done they've got hearts and a crown so because I wanted to replace the one that I lost and so I'm gonna be really careful when I wear these rubies because they cost me a pretty penny <laughs> and if I lose one of these I'm going to scream because I cannot replace these so yeah these are absolutely beautiful and like pigeons blood red so that's awesome I'll be careful not to lose those. Um, let's see. From Nicole's eBay store, this really pretty ring she sent me as a free gift with purchase. And so you have little um, little lab opals there and a some sort of a green CZ. And I guess this is cubic zirconia, I guess. But the ring is sterling silver and it's very, very pretty very very pretty I love that um, I ordered this gorgeous ring from her store now this is cubic zirconia 
and it is gold over silver look at the setting on that ring though look at that you don't find rings like that the prongs are really thick this ring is absolutely gorgeous needs a little bit of a cleaning but it's beautiful so beautiful so that came from Nicole's store. Um, let me see. What's this? Okay, so from JTV, which I'm gonna have to cut this video short because it's really long. So I put this in here. You guys know this is from John's store. Now this is gold over brass. It's been in the previous video. But I purchased this gorgeous amethyst from JTV. And it also has like a princess setting to it. And it's a five carat amethyst. It's beautiful. I hope you guys can see it. But it stacks so beautifully with this ring from John's store. So I've been keeping them in the same box together. <laughs> so pretty. Um, let me see if I can grab something white here to show you so yeah this ring from John store even though it's not gold or silver it's just gold over brass stacks so nicely with this ring from JTV and since John's fashion jewelry is so good quality I might be able to actually wear these together um, the rose gold is a spot-on match to JTV's so it's okay to mix your fine jewelry with your costume. Look at that. Perfect match. So when I tell you John has amazing costume jewelry, he really, really does. And I can sleep in this. It doesn't turn me colors. I've showered in it. It doesn't turn. So I just thought how beautiful. Um, I got this ring in a mystery box from his store. And it matches with the uh, ring I just ordered from JTV. So very happy about that. And let me show you the matching piece and then I'll end this video here because there's so much more to show you guys. Um, so yeah, I also got the matching amethyst earrings in rose gold from JTV. These are lever backs and they're absolutely gorgeous. They had them in yellow gold and they had them in silver but I got the rose because I have a pendant that matches and I just think amethyst and rose gold is so gorgeous so yeah guys that's gonna be it for this video thank you for watching and stay tuned because I didn't even make a dent in this box so <laughs> stay tuned bye Lamazons.